Hello everyone, Erroneous here, and I just got the stupidest idea that I absolutely have to do. So, <laughs> I was thinking about my favorite card, and I realized when people have a good set of tools, they say that they're decked out. So I need to rename all of these as cards. I just have to. <laughs> also get you guys bred up. <laughs> uh, that's funny. I just realized my base is in a cave like right there. I moved villagers all the way from my old base there and there was a village right here. Alright guys, guess who we have on today? It's been a little while. Yeah, just just a little while. I've been on like without you guys. It's just like I haven't been playing with you. <laughs> yeah. So Mangled here has been working on a castle to put Rosses to shame. Hopefully. I'm not quite sure why, but I'm all in. He says I can build some shops in it, and uh, you know that'll be. Well, I already fun. have like like three houses in this world, right? So. I, uh, oh really? I thought I only had one. Yeah. No. And I want another one. <laughs> I, I, I don't know, that's my favorite part about Minecraft is just the building, so... Mm -hmm. That's where all my resources just goes down the drain real quick. <laughs> what? So I just came out of my portal and there's this huge pit in front of it with a bunch of lava <laughs> at the bottom under glass. That's crazy. I'm going to say that, that was probably Ross. But, oh my gosh, that gave me a mini heart attack. <laughs> Alright, on my way. Alright, I'm here. Okay, I'm in my gym. Alright, uh, I'm guessing that's inside the house and down. Let's see your name Correct. tag. You can just stay up there, I'm about okay, to come just, up. Where do you want this stone? And also, where is this thing you're working on? Um, it's this way. Also, there's a skeleton horse. I got one already, if you want it. Yeah, I saw you had like three of them in a pit over there somewhere. Yeah. Definitely rather large. Alright, uh, so where do you want the stone then? Uh, I have those chests over there if you want to just put it in the large chest, it's fine. Alright. Do you think you'll need more? Uh, perhaps. We'll see. Probably. Right. Well, if you need any more, just let me know. Uh, okay. Before I go, do you want to check out and see what all we've got? Uh, I saw the last couple of videos you made. Well, I mean, but like, you haven't seen how to get there, though. Because you just told uh, me a couple of seconds ago that you didn't know how to get to the tunnel. I'll probably be alright. I forgot about this. I have a zombie villager here. It looks like a librarian. Named and stuck in a pit. Oh, I saw it. That might be useful. Things just like not spawn as much when it's raining or what's going on here. So right. Ross has invited me to come over to something that he's been working on next to his base. I think yeah, it's the it's reason that he asked for so much stone. I'm just gonna keep heading in this direction. Flat. I see it. Oh my god, there is so much lag on the server Dang, right that now. thing is big. So, for those who don't know, this is me replicating a base that I made in RimWorld. So, this is one of four areas of defense. All the sand counts as sandbags, and there used to be four giant-ass turrets here, as well as six miniature ones, oh, seven miniature ones. Any end rod or standing lamps. Follow me for the more fun part. Don't go in that door. This door? You'll be there soon enough. No, don't go through that door. This was the tippy top of the base. Instead of just nothing, there were solar panels and... It was, uh... Two wind turbines keeping the place all powered up and stuff. Could have replicated Another the solar defense panels. Area. 
Just need some nether quartz. They're tilted, and I want to make them tilt. If you will, follow me. This was kind of a hallway slash storage area. I would have all of my armor and spare clothes and stuff just kind of pressed up against this wall. And there were multiple exits through here because it's hard to navigate through the solar panels. This is my vault of really important shit. I think I only have one doomsday launcher left. So, uh, that's fun. Now, we move to the heart of the base. <laughs> uh. <laughs> heart of the base, huh? Uh-huh. Uh, the levers open and close air vents and air conditioning units. Oh my, I aim. Anyway, the room... Oh, we, hmm. uh, um, the hallways really to... Uh, hold on. But anyway, the room that you walked into was kind of the workshop space where you saw all those machines and etc. There's a room in here oh. with a green screen and a uh, dispenser. Yes, that is the dining room. Am I back in the game? I'm kind of back in the game. I saw you join. I'm back. I'm back! Okay. So that was a nutrient paste dispenser. And you just walk through the kitchen. This is the freezer. How it works is in the game you would put raw materials here or in one of the hoppers behind. And then when you wanted to, it would use a small amount of those raw resources to create nutrient paste. It wasn't the best tasting, but it wouldn't get you sick. Often. This here... This used to be kind of... It was kind of the barn hallway because we used to have a ton of huskies. And we would just line this hallway with... Beds for them and... It, it was a cuddly call. What did I call? It was a cuddly hallway. No. Or a cuddly corridor. Oh, hold on. I gotta mute myself. These corners don't quite look like they're matching up right. I can tell that they are, but the textures don't look quite right. So, I'm sure you saw the uh, giant garden. Yeah, I saw that when I was flying over. So, I've had to simulate a lot of this, and a lot of it just translated to wheat, but there was smoke leaf, there's corn, there's rice, there's potatoes, etc. Now, there are seasons in RimWorld, so the uh, shape of the- oh, Dude! Sorry. It's like one of the oldest rules in Minecraft, not to jump around crops. Do you think I carry a hoe on me? Uh, well, whatever. Shut up. Yeah. I have one in my, uh, one second, I have one in here. No. This was kind of a busy area, but I can't simulate anything in it. This was our long range mineral scanner, which would detect, like, random meteorite kind of strikes of ore, like gold and whatever you chose to scan for. It was about a 3x3 three three area. And the rest of the space was dedicated to a single mortar, which stood right here. There was storage for ammunition in here and over here. There were also transport pods that would basically fling a certain amount of... a certain weight from one area to another. They were fun. I think I had three of those. This this is the hospital. I wasn't able to replicate the life support systems or the artworks that I had. That in there was a the medicine closet where we kept everything. This is another hallway. You know, this did actually happen in RimWorld once or twice. Um, <laughs> this is a special room because this room wasn't supposed to exist. After I had already, like, beaten the game and sent everybody off on a ship and stuff like that. 
I decided I'm gonna mod the crap out of my game and then play on this world. And then an entire new colony stemmed from that, full of cultists and crap. Um, but this was basically the kind of library where it had like a writer's area and bookshelves, which aren't vanilla in the game. This, this was helpful. This was our recreation room where we had a chess table, a pool table, a poker table, some comfy chairs, and a television. <laughs> and there was probably artwork somewhere around here, but I can't redo the sculptures. What's with the, uh, the observer? Uh, I thought it would make a nice back for the TV. Oh, it's a TV. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Now for the fun part. Uh, that's into the hallway. This is prison area. And it's double-sided, that's where the other vent leads. There is a mimicked room on the opposite side. So the orange beds were always prisoner areas. So to the right, we have another prisoner area. This one was a shared room, so less happy prisoners stayed here. And now for the place of sadness. This here is my crematorium, basically. We would smelt old bodies and old weapons. And I can't recreate marble sarcophagi. So this is the Hall of the Dead. Oh, uh, fun fact. The other side of this room was where we would keep corpses of our enemies. <coughs> Legitimately. Catch me if you can! Where'd you go? What's I that? am coming for you! Uh, oh shit! No! <laughs> uh, oh, come on, thank you. You built the base, no! Yeet. How did you? Oh. I got lost in my own base. Where are you? I duped and scooted. But yeah, that is Metal Seed, the base of the home wreckers. Too low. Welcome to my wool farm. That is really inefficient. I don't care. I could make this thing like a I single don't. block no, 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 and be no, no, more this efficient. Is my this is my creation. Mine. No one shall tamper with it. And this this is the collection system. And I have a stack in 48. Which I should take upstairs. So this might be causing a bit of lag. Yeah. The system that I have doesn't cause lag. <laughs> what system do you have for wool? Well, I don't have one currently, but the one that I have that I could build does not cause lag. Is it one block? Basically. Yeah, I was thinking of making it something like that. I think that, it's like yeah. two by three by four for the entire yeah. device. That's too big. Two wide by three long by four tall. Yours yeah, was one, two, three five by, by five like, by five. Yeah, it was a lot Which bigger. Is but it's perfect numerically. Sure. I gotta head out. So. I guess. Yeah. See you later. See you. Alright guys, I have no idea what happened. I'm waiting back to hear from the, uh... Okay, the admin is contacting me. Oops. Oh, that's not good. Um, but apparently, all of the player stuff has been either erased or moved, so I'm gonna try and see what happened there and see if we can get our stuff back, because I just respawned at the main spawn with nothing. So, yeah. Okay, he's looking into it, and I'm running back to the bases, but this is really weird. Like, I hope I didn't lose everything, because this is, uh... All, all the buildings are still here, and I don't think I had too much on myself when I got off last, but I really hope I didn't have too much on me. Oh, I had all of my armor and tools on me, didn't I? That would suck if that got lost.
Well everyone, I'm afraid to say that the Dapper Gaff server of Perdon may be lost. After talking with Ross for a while, it turns out that the server computer has been infected with ransomware. All of the files on the computer have been encrypted, and we really don't want to give in to those guys. So, we're probably not going to get the world back. If we do, obviously you'll see it in the next episode or so, but on that sad note, I'm going to have to end things off here. So, as always, if you like the video, go ahead and leave a thumbs up. If you did not like it, leave a thumbs down. Don't leave a thumbs down, I don't really care. Subscribe if you feel like it. And as always, have a nice one, friends. Adios.